Hey campers, Carl from Pete's RV Center here. Today we are looking at the 2019 Airstream Flying Cloud 25 FB. This is a front bed floor style travel trailer and we're gonna be showing you around it today so you have an idea of what to expect when you're checking out your next Airstream. First off, right up front, we do have a power tongue jack, nice and easy to get you up off the tow rig, leveled out, and to your camping experience even faster. Right behind that, you've got areas to keep both your propane tanks and your batteries both covered to help protect the batteries and tanks from corrosion, rust, anything like that, the elements in general. Up here over the windows, you'll notice this is a UV protectant and shatter resistant covering. It's great to help protect your investment and the same goes along with these stainless steel rock covers. You don't want to be damaging the aluminum with any of rocks uh, that are coming up off your tow unit, anything like that. So that right there is just a little forethought to help protect that investment for the years to come. These things last for a long time. Airstream's been around since the 1930s and you still see a high percentage of them uh, still on the road. Right here, you've got small little storage space, keep a, some extra goodies in there. Right now we've got your detachable power cord as well. Great little space to store some things and of course easy to access because they are on the door side. You do have your Zipti awning up top as well. That is a manual awning. Roll that right on out. It's gonna provide you with plenty of shade come the evening hours or the early morning hours, the midday, you know, when the sun's just really beating down on you and you gotta get away. Down below, you've got, this is a dual axle trailer. You've got Alcoa aluminum wheels. They are weighted and balanced at the Airstream factory. Airstream is one of the only manufacturers, the only manufacturer that does that. And it greatly improves the towability of the unit. And of course, just taking a general overall look at this travel trailer, you'll notice Airstream, it's always been known for its silver bullet design, something that is iconic and is going to stand out now and for years to come. So now we've kind of taken a look at the outside of this Airstream flying cloud. Let's head on inside and see what the actual floor plan has to offer. All right, folks, now that we're inside the 25 FB Flying Cloud, I wanna show you around, but first off is a testament to Airstream's build quality. You can always tell by when you shut the door of something. So on Airstreams, when you shut the door, it's just like on an airplane. It's not gonna see, like let anything out. All your hot air come those winter months or the cold air from the air conditioning on those summer months is not gonna be able to escape out of this door. It seals nice, tight, and shut. So, great choice to have. Now, towards the back, you'll notice you do have this booth style dinette. In this unit that we're in right now, it is the Wild Honey interior. So it does have a very soft yet vibrant color to it. And of course, I think that these slightly darker uh, countertops and tabletops really accent it great. Up above the dinette, you'll see you do have storage couple of doors here they are sprung so you have to be a little bit careful when you open them that they don't come out and hit you but you've got a dvd player in here you've got a couple of usb ports you've also got more multimedia here whether it's am fm radio cd something of the sorts and then we'll kind of have you zoom in up here you've also got a small little microphone so that way you are able to if somebody calls in and you have your phone connected to the bluetooth you're able to have that conversation without even having your phone on you can be in the bedroom and you can be having that conversation here and not have to worry about a thing you do have more storage underneath here so great little place to store a few things easy to grab that way they're right inside the door same goes for down below here underneath the kind of lounge chairs. Airstream has even provided you with some totes to keep, keep your things a little bit more organized. That way they're not always flying around and getting all jostled and jumbled when you're bringing this thing from A to B. So, and the lounge chair here too, great thing to have. It gives you a great seating area, whether you're just entertaining with friends or if you're gonna be watching some TV here as well at the end of the night or early in the morning if you like to catch that news broadcast. So now we've kind of checked out the back, we're gonna make our way forward, kind of check out the kitchen and the rest of the unit. All right, 
So now that we're in the kitchen area, let's check it out. Of course, first off, you have this residential fridge. Nice, tall, wide, gonna have plenty of space in here for you to bring anything and everything you need. Don't forget, you do also have the freezer attached to this as well. And it is both dual electric and propane with an automatic changeover. So you never have to worry about running out of battery juice or running out of LP. It's gonna take care of itself, change it over. That way your food's not gonna go bad. Over on this side, you'll notice there's plenty of storage, actually very convenient, very well hidden. Great way to store, you know, spices or anything like that. A little bit more storage up top if you want to throw like a small pan. Same goes, these spring-loaded uh, cupboards up top. You're going to find these all throughout the Airstreams, you know, no matter really what the, uh, what the model is, what the floor plan is, they're really handy to have. You do have three burner cooktop here with convection microwave underneath. Again, I know I keep hammering this, but more and more storage all throughout. All the drawers are gonna give you plenty, plenty here. You even have a handmade silverware holder. So these are very special Airstream. They put a handmade one in every single Airstream that leaves the lot. No other manufacturer does that and they're high quality, they're gonna last. Same goes for the entire trailer. Of course, very heavy duty sink cover. You can you know, get, just garner a little bit more counter space by using it, but it does cover this big, deep stainless steel sink. You've got Moen faucet on this as well. And I mean, you find Moen is a household name. It's gonna be in most of your homes as well. Again, storage underneath. Airstream even has this thing figured out that they've got a special spot just for your trash can there. So don't have to worry about leaving it out of the cupboard or anything in case, you know, your dog gets to it or, you know, you just don't really want that smell wafting throughout the entire trailer. Um, so now as we make our way back, first thing I'm going to show you is going to be the bath here. So your shower, it's got a small step in, but drops back down. So it gives you the additional headroom for you taller folks. Make your way up. You've got a seat you can hang out in if you're washing up, washing your feet, anything. You do notice a handy clothesline in there as well. So Airstream's kind of figured that in. It's nice to be able to have a place you can just hang some clothes and let them air dry. So now we're gonna swing around and check out the bathroom. So this bathroom, you can see in here, there's plenty of foot room for you when you're sitting down on the throne. You can see there's also plenty of storage in there. So you've got, you can tuck all of your toiletries, extra toilet paper. You've got another, another nice small little sink. Plugins as well for your electric razor. Again, you know, storage, storage, storage. You've got also a really big mirror up top here and even more storage up behind there. And of course, super bright in here. So you never really want to miss anything like that. And now, of course, into the front bedroom. This is a great place to be. It's very relaxing. You can shut yourself off at the end of the night. All you gotta do is shut your curtain here. Nobody else is gonna be bothering you. So if you do have friends that are staying here with you and you've converted your dinette into another bed, you can have your own private space come the end of the day. You've got a wardrobe here, already got the curtain rod in it, so you can be hanging your dress shirts, regular shirts, and dresses more and more cabinets and drawers here, you know, underwear, socks. You've even got a little door down here. It's not that big of a storage space, but it's great if you're a nighttime reader. You can keep a couple of books or magazines in there. Of course, the reading lights up here make it really easy. Flick those on and off. They've got these handy little switches on the back of them, and you can really angle these any which way. So if you want to point the light upwards, give yourself a little bit more ambiance, or if you want to point it down towards the book that you're reading, you know, go right for it. Across here, again, the cupboards up top, spring-loaded. There's more storage than what you would ever know what to do with in these Airstreams. Down below over here, I'll have you zoom in, Nate, just a little bit. You've got a charging center, so you've got a couple of 110 plugins as well as a couple of USB plugins as well. So if you forget the charging brick for your iPad or your phone, you know, just plug the cable right in there. They've thought that out, they've got it taken care of. So then, and again, storage, storage, storage. Up underneath this bed here, you can check it out. You've got even more totes for you to keep all of your stuff in. You've got 
you know, these deeper areas in here as well. I mean, really, you can turn an Airstream into your home away from home and you can make it your main home. People love to take these, park them on a lot and just keep them there, build a deck around them, but it's whatever you want to do. It's your adventure to start and we want you to start it here at Pete's RV Center. So if you wanna take a look at this flying cloud, others like it and other models that we do carry and have in stock, please feel free to get in touch with us, find us online, give us a call or check us out on Facebook. We can't wait to see you on the lot folks and happy camping.